Hi there and welcome to part 8 of the Autodesk Factory Design Suite tutorial here at Man & Machine TV. I'm James Smith, Factory Specialist at Man & Machine and in today's episode I will be covering working with point cloud data. Have a look at some point cloud data. Point cloud data is a set of vertices in a three dimensional coordinate system so it's a bit like mesh as such and these are determined by the X and Y and Z coordinates so as you would when you're des designing a component. They're created by scanners which can scan anything from small components such as generators or large components such as complete factories. Obviously time scale changes and they take quite a while if you're going to scan a complete factory. I'm going to run you through and show you a brief example. Um, I'm going to open some examples up in Navisworks. It is worth noting that you can use point cloud data as it is supported in Inventor and AutoCAD which is in the factory design suite package also. We'll now look at the AutoCAD template that I've imported in. So you can see here, so this is just to show how you can use your 2D data as well. I'm now going to open and unhide a 3D object we have created within Inventor. So you can see that here. And now I'm going to turn on some of my point cloud data. So as you can see here, I'm just going to use one of the viewpoints um, to have a look. So you can see now it's incorporated in. So the thing where it really kind of brings some value to the business is as you can see here, one of the um, conveyors is actually clashing with the column. So this is something you could find out a lot earlier in the design process and just save a lot of rework on site. You can also use the review feet, um, tools within Navisworks, so it's an intelligent part. You can see it's snapping here, so I can pick points here, and take dimensions, I can convert them to redline and add any comments. Um, so that's just a short but brief example of how you can use point cloud data with your 2D and 3D models. In next week's show, I will be covering Factory Mods, which is a free download from Autodesk Labs. If you have any questions relating to today's episode, just email factory at manamachine.co.uk and I'll do my best to answer them in the next show. To keep up to date with all the latest news, follow us on Twitter at UK or find us on Facebook and LinkedIn. Thanks again and we look forward to seeing you next time.